Happy Tuesday, September 22nd, 2020. Today I'm gonna show you how to make ginger tea. So, um, you're gonna get your ginger. You know, it looks, it looks like this. This is what ginger looks like. And it gets peeled. And I, you could peel it however you want. You could use a peeler. I'm using a knife. So um, once you get it all peeled, you're gonna take a hammer and you're gonna smash it a little bit because smashing it allows the flavors and all the good stuff in the ginger to permeate and make the tea. So there's probably about, you know, a handful of ginger here. And I'm just gonna make a small batch of it. There's six cups of water in here. I'm gonna put a cinnamon stick in it, give it some flavor. You could add sugar to your cup of tea, but it's fine the way it is. It'll be kind of on the spicy hot side. Uh, if you want, you could put a slice of lemon in with this. So here, this is gonna go on the stove. As soon as it starts to boil, I'm gonna set the timer for five minutes. I'm gonna let it boil for five minutes. When it's done boiling, I'm going to put it on simmer with the lid just barely off a little bit. It's gonna simmer for an additional 30 minutes and then it's ready. That's it. This is the ginger tea. Benefits of ginger tea. It's great for di for digestion, you know. Um, it, it smells wonderful. Um, ginger is an anti-inflammatory. So if you've got joint issues, arthritis issues, this is the stuff you wanna drink. Um, also, um, Mmm, it has a, an exotic peppery flavor. Um, if you have asthma, um, asthma is a condition of chronic inflammation of the airwaves. And research shows if you can, um, that you can control your asthma um, and reduce its severity by drinking this ginger tea. Mm, you gotta try this. You're gonna like it. It doesn't need sugar. Today you are you that is truer than true. There is no one alive who is youer than you. <laughs>